video online. Now, for this video, we are talking about chapter 3 homework, alright? Now, I know it is a long due homework and you have been waiting for an explanation. So, sorry if I'm a little bit late, alright? Now, let's not waste time and begin looking at questions, alright? Now, here, the first question, uh, one and only one, about public enterprise. Alright, as a revision, remember, public enterprise, there are actually two types of public uh, uh, three types, yeah, three types in your textbook, three types, but in general, you can think like this. Whenever we talk about public enterprise, it means this. It's either a government department, all right, or another one, we say organization, not just any organization, but organization that is set up by law. Alright, set up by law. For example, if you go to the uh, if you go to the website of the legislative um, council, alright, now you can find a lot of laws. Something like Gonti Tiulaya, MTR by laws, or uh, university, Zhong Dai Tiulaya, Gong Dai Tiulaya. Those organizations, the universities, MTR and different things, they are set up by laws. So in this sense, they are also public enterprise, all right? We call them public corporation. All right, now, let's look at it. Here, the first one, RTHK, if you look up the law, you should be able to find there is a broadcast, you should be able to find that. So, the first one, yes, it is a public enterprise. Now, second one, now this one, our best friend, HKEAA, right? How many people you should know, using your common sense, examination and assessment authority. Of course, it is a public enterprise. Now, the third one, the Hong Kong and Shanghai Banking. Now, the long name, the full name, you may not know it, but if I try to shorten it, it's HSBC. HSBC, Alright? So this one, you should know, they are a private commercial bank, alright? A private commercial bank. So this one, no, alright? No, this one is not a public enterprise, alright? Although it is quite big in scale, alright? So the answer here, one and two should be B. Alright? Now, next one. Ah, we talk about private enterprise. Alright? Now, for private enterprise, remember, we have three big types. Uh, actually, two big categories. Alright? And then four subcategories. Now, let's see how that. On one hand, remember, with, without legal entity. And on the other hand, we have with legal entity. Yeah, all legal entity, the more legal entity, you did that. Those of you who forget, remember, legal entity refers to whether the law will treat you as a separate individual. All right? Now, without legal entity, we have, of course, on one hand, we have sole proprietor. Uh, yeah. Sole proprietorship. And then, the plural version, we have partnership. On another hand, with legal entity, we have a private limited company. And we have public limited company. Like HGR. Don't just write limited company. No marks. No marks, alright? You have to write private or public, alright? Now, if you want to know the details, I will shoot a revision videos on chapter 3 later, alright? Or see how enjoy Now, first, uh, the second question here. ABC Flower Shop is a sole proprietor. Now, let's look at it one by one. 
Therefore, the owner can make a contract with others in the name of the flower shop. Now, he said, "Can use the flower shop's name to make a contract." The problem is, the problem is. Now, think about it. We know sole proprietor, no separate legal entity. That is why, in law, it is not a unit. You cannot use its name to make a contract or、uh, be sued by that. All right. So, no. The reason is simple because we don't have we don't have legal entity. That is why you cannot use the name of the flower shop. All right. Now, next one. It can issue shares to raise capital. No, remember shares. Only private limited company or、uh, public limited company. They they can share. Uh, they can issue shares. All right. 嗱，记住得有限公司先至可以有 share 同 bonds 啊。其他咩 partnership 啊，咩 sole proprietorship 啊，同埋嗰啲啊 public enterprise 啊。关事噶，得唔得？政府部门唔会有 share 嘅。All right, now C. The owner's loss is not confined to the amount of his investment. 嗱，嗱，咁啊啦 ，not confined 呢度 ，not confined or not limited. Basically, here it is saying, in another word, it is saying it has limited liabilities. All right. 好啦。從個名你要估到啦 ，only private and public limited company. The owners will have limited、uh, limited liabilities. Here, sole proprietorship. Of course, this one is not correct. All right. So the answer is. Wait, 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 wait. I think I make. Ah,、oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Here, here. Sorry, sorry, sorry. C, not confined. So it basically means it has. Unlimited liabilities, which is exactly the case. Ah, 死我啊！做乜？系唔好意思啊，口残口残。The answer should be C. All right. Now, D for D. The flower shop can continue to run even if the owners goes bankrupt. No, all right. No. Remember, sole proprietorship and partnership, because they have no separate legal entity. Basically, when the owner He dies, or、uh, he goes bankrupt. It's basically done in terms of in the eyes of law. All right, so no continuation. 基本上都系死咗噶啦，唔存在噶啦呢个，所以冇嘅，系冇 continuity 嘅，得唔得 ？All right, so this one. Sorry, sorry, 口残啊，搞错嘢头先。<coughs> Answer should be C. All right. Now let's move on to the next one. Next one, here, Kelly and Sherman are the owners of a coffee shop. Ah, 首先啊 owners. We see there are two owners, right? Now we have two owners. So we know, 唔使睇啦 Sole proprietary, sole proprietorship. No, 一定唔系独资经营啦 They are personally liable to all charges of the coffee shops. Now this one. Personally liable to all. Basically, translating this sentence, it means they have unlimited liabilities. 基本上就等于 unlimited liabilities. Ah,、uh, so immediately we know not sole proprietorship, but facing unlimited liabilities. We know this coffee shop belongs to. Partnership, all right? 係咪啊？即係合夥啦。So let's see which one is correct about partnership. Now, only Kelly is responsible. No, remember, for a partnership, they are collectively responsible. All right. The partners they are collectively responsible for each other's action. All right, 係咪啊？一齊啊，集體負責噶。是但一個借咗債 ，any one make a loan, and then all the partners will be fully responsible. 
any one of them will be fully responsible. That is what we call collectively responsible. Or you remember in our notes, we say jointly and severally liable, all right? Whichever you want, all right? So this one is shorter. So use collectively responsible. Now, next one, Kelly and Sherman can issue can issue shares and bonds. No, I have guy that you got to for why. All right. Now, if Sherman withdraws, the coffee shop has to be dissolved. Yes, this is the answer. Because again, remember, partnership, no separate legal entity. So any partner, when they withdraw or or uh, go bank go bankrupt. All right. Basically, in the eyes of law, is that. Alright, it's dead. 死咗噶啦，嗰个人系咪？咁个人死咗，个人破产，计冇得继续啦，系咪 ？So dissolve. This is the answer. D. Kelly and Sherman have to share their profits and loss equally. 从来都冇人讲过啊。No one says they need to share equally. So no. Alright, no. Now let's move on. Here, number four. Chris ran an optical shop. In the form of a sole proprietorship, now I'm very tired. Am I? Basically, quite easy. Later, his friend joined him to run the shop together, and the optical shops turns into a partnership. Okay, lah. 即系讲简单啲，而家又啊 ，we turn from sole proprietorship into a partnership. All right. 独资变成合伙啦。Which of the following is most likely the motive? Of the action now, a to obtain independent legal status. No, remember, sole proprietorship and partnership both are without legal entity. All right. No, b to enjoy limited. I'm gonna find why. All right. Now, c to make to make the decision making more flexible. Now, this one, remember, flexible. Think about it. As the number of owner increases, number of owner increases. Remember, flexibility should be decreased. Why? Because the more people you make the decision, the more people you need to ask for their opinion. Which sometimes, as you do your group projects, remember LS group projects. Other group projects, you should know. The more people you have, the more conflicts you will have. So your flexibility, all right, 冇咁大弹性啊 will actually be lowered. So this one, no, all right. Now D to expand the source of capital. Yes, this one is correct. Now why? Why? 人多咗，自然多咗资金来源啦，系咪啊？多咗一个家庭，多咗啲女朋友、男朋友可以借钱嘛 ，right? So. This one is the correct answer. All right. Now, moving on. Moving on. Now, if firm A is a limited company, now here, limited. Now, limited. Now, we haven't talked about private or public. So, this one we know, limited company at least we know must have legal entity, and then the owners must must have limited liabilities as well. All right. At least we know this too, and we have continuity. So the first one, bankruptcy of a shareholders will not affect the continuity of the firm. Now this one is a standard answer. Remember why? Very simple, because they have separate legal entity. So even if the shareholder dies, in the eyes of the law, the limited company and the shareholders are. Totally different person. One die, it will not affect the company as a person, as a unit. All right, as an independent unit. All right. Now, second, ownership and management must be separated. Now we say ownership and management in a limited company can be separated. 系啦，有机会嘅。我哋之前讲啦，明白 ？We can have board of director, the shareholders. Most of the time, in a public limited company, listed company, they may not be the managers, all right. But no one says, no one says it must be separated. It should be, it can be separate, separated, not must be. So this one, not correct. 
那 finally liability of the shareholders is confined to investment. Basically, it's saying limited liabilities. All right. Basically, it means limited liabilities. This one is correct. So we know answer one and three should be B here. All right. Not too difficult. Not too difficult. Now let us move on. Yeah. Next question. Next question. Now someone choose to open open a store in the form of a private limited company. Now private now they a private limited company instead of a public instead of a public limited company. All right. Now remember, private limited company and public limited company. Basically, the only thing in common, we are talking about legal entity and continuity, limited liability. The other things, they are totally different. All right, that is the reason why in examination you can't just write limited company. No, all right, no, that would be a zero mark. All right, now we see, this is because now he choose to be a private. In some of public, so let's see. We need to find an advantage of a private limited company over public limited company. Or they want got private the whole thing, the public is not. So let's see. Now, this is because less capital is required for setting up a private limited company. No, no one has said it. Is it? Both of them need to go to registration. We see registration. And then they have to pay a fee. They have to get license and that kind of thing. Now, this one, this one, a, how would it be correct if if the question is asking about listed company instead of public limited company? Then I would say a is correct because you know in Hong Kong, if you want to be a listed company, you need to go through a lot of. Extra procedures, lah. Or they call the IPO, ah, am I? Or they call the what? IPO, ah. Initial public offering. All right. Now, when I study law, I also learn a bit of it. Remember, the average cost of hiring the lawyers and different people, the professionals for an IPO, am I? Or you talk about IPO, ah. We are talking about. This amount, um, yes, we are talking about this amount. All right, total fee, this amount. All right. So, if the question changes to private in some of a listed company, then I will say A is a correct answer. All right. Unfortunately, not this time because remember, public limited company, it is not the same. As a listed company, all right, not the same, all right. Listed company is a type of public listed、uh, public limited company, but not the same, all right. Now here, B, shares of right, I want to see that. Now shares of private limited company can be trans、uh, can be freely transferred. This is actually totally incorrect because remember, private limited company, they cannot freely transfer. They need consent. 嗱，又唔好就咁寫 need consent 喎，冇分喎 ，all right need consent of other shareholders。嗱，唔好就咁寫 need consent 啊，唔係，係 need consent of other shareholders， all right don't miss this， don't miss this， all right so this one is actually totally wrong， all right now here a private limited company do not need to disclose its financial status to the public。Well， this is the standard answer， 記住啦。Private limited company, 唔使公開自己嘅財務狀況啊嘛 ，all right, no need to disclose. And a and D, a private limited company pays a lower and gone a fair way. All right, now next one, next one, next one. A public limited company. Now let's see. First of all, can they issue shares and bonds? Of course they can. All right, they can issue shares and bonds. Limited company, all limited companies. They can issue shares and bonds. Now this one, they talk about to the public. All right, to the public. 咁啦，呢個就係 public 嘅意思咯。Public limited company. Of course, they can share and they can issue publicly. All right. Now the transfer of ownership for a public limited company. Remember, they do not need 
they do not need the consent. All right, 係唔需要 consent 嘅。So this one answer is B. 嗱唔嘥時間啦。This one quite standard. All right. Now moving on, moving on. Now here number eight. A chink's next door turns from a private into a listed. Now this one is different. Now this one contrast with question six. All right, the next one contrast contrast with question six. All right, now 呢个啦，同第六条对比下啦，要 now here we talk about private into a listed. This time we are quite specific. We are talking about listed. All right, now. After listing, the company needs to pay a high. No, this one is not correct. All right, we know not correct. 大家都系俾咁多嘅啫，十六点 percent. As of now, all right. As of uh now, yeah. As of this date, 因为惊啊，点解你傻仔啊？两年后睇片啊，惊你啊。As of this date, we are still talking about sixteen point five percent. Of property tax rate, all right? How many as of today? Now, next one. The upper limit of shareholders is fifty. No lah. Now, remember, list her, list her should be unlimited. Wow, you limit to fifty dollars, big thing lah. Do you buy股票啊 All right, should be unlimited. Now, less accounting information is required. Not will lah. Should not see too less less information. Yeah, should be all the accounting information is required to be disclosed. Ma, am I to the public? All right, to the public. Now the next one, the company is at at a greater risk of being taken over. This is the answer. Now, how to explain it? Think about it for two seconds. All right, two, one, zero. Now remember. When we talk about take over, 我哋啊俾人收購啊，我哋講緊係得唔得？收購啊會。How to explain in short question? They are at a greater risk because because of what? Because the transfer of ownership does not requires. Consent of other shareholders, other owners, 係嘛？你唔使問準人啊，就可以 transfer。That's the reason why you are at greater risk because you don't have a good control over your ownership. All right, so easy. Now let's move on. Next question here, number nine. Compared to a partnership. All right, which of the following is not an advantage? Or that you're going to public limited company? We know public limited company versus partnership. Now we are we are public limited company. We need to see which one is not an advantage. All right, now one more one. Accounting information can be kept secret. We know public limited company must disclose. All right, must disclose. To the public, all right. To the public, I am am to the am with him. All right, must disclose. So A is not an advantage. All right. Now B, there are wider source of capital. Of course, or of course, this is correct because here. Remember, because public limited company can issue shares and bonds to the public. That's the main point. 嗱，記住啊！你哋考，你哋有啲人喺功課寫錯啊。Some of you get it wrong in your、uh, homework. All right, you say issuing shares and bonds. Then you have wider source of capital. No, the main point is you can share issues and bonds to the public. This is the main point. 唔係有 share 同 bonds 係多，就係、是、wider source 啊，係可以向公眾。發售 share 同 bonds 先至係個 main point， alright？ So this one is correct。嗱 ，next one， the firm has lasting continuity， 唔解啦。This one of course。嗱 ，loss of shareholders is confined。嗱 ，loss or liabilities， alright？ Or liabilities is confined to their investment。嗱 ，this one basically they means limited liabilities， right？ 係咪啊？基本上啊，就話佢嘅負債係有限啦。Yes, this is a very important advantage of both 
private limited company and public limited company. All right, very easy. Moving on. All right, here next one, next one. La, get you that. Now next one. Whenever we see such kind of questions from A and from B, the first job we need to do, we need, we need to identify, identify what type of firm it is. All right. Now here it says. From A and from B, now 10 and 2, so totally, this is not a sole proprietor, alright? Not a sole proprietorship. Now, next one. Next one. Firm A, unlimited, alright? Unlimited, unlimited liability. Alright? Not a sole proprietorship, but unlimited liability. Immediately, you know, this will be a partnership, alright? 即刻知道,这个是一个 partnership, right? Now, here, what about firm B? Firm B, we know limited, but remember, for limited company, we have both private and public. We still have to decide whether it's a private or public, alright? Now here, it says, disclose to the owners only. So, you know, this is telling us this is a private limited company because if it is a public limited company, then you have to disclose to the public, all right? Now, now our job becomes so much easier, all right? Basically, private limited company versus partnership here. According to the above information, now, according to the above information, firm A can sue others in the name of company. While firm B cannot, actually, it's just the opposite. Firm B can do it because firm B, we have separate legal entity. But here, we don't have separate legal entity. So this one, just the opposite, all right? Just the opposite. Now here, firm A pays a lower profit tax rate than firm B in Hong Kong. Yes, this is the answer. Remember, partnership, they have lower profit tax rate, lower profit tax rate than the private limited company, all right? So what about C? Firm A has more sources of capital than B. Now, this one, of course, it is wrong. Because the right answer, this is the wrong word. We know, right? Should be. Firm B has a wider source than Firm A. No! Slap yourself. If you're thinking like this, slap yourself. Come Wrong. Now, firm A and firm B, both are private. Alright, what I mean, both cannot issue any money publicly. So, actually, Firm A and Firm B, their sources of capital are the same, alright? They are the same. Same joy di me ya, dai ga do m lan go gong hoi, li dim zi, bin go go sauce, hai food di ya, hai mai ya. So, boys, please don't make this mistake again. Partnership and private limited company, you cannot compare their sources of capital because the reason is simple both can only get money privately, not publicly, alright? Now, D here. Setting up firm A involves a more complicated, no, just the opposite. Firm B is more complicated, alright? Now, let us move on. Huh, four more MCs and then we can move on to the short questions and long questions. Now, Miss Chow Boutique winds up, winds up. She does not need to use her personal asset to settle. Now, this sentence, she does not need to use her personal asset. Now, basically, it's telling us, which means liability is limited. Alright, liabilities is limited. Basically, it means, so we know here, it must be a private or a public limited company. This is the answer. Now, let's look at that. Sole proprietorship, partnership, sole proprietorship. Now, all three here, 
A, B, and C, they both, at least one of them will face uh, face unlimited liability. So the answer is D. Very easy. Now, next topic, shares and bonds. Shares and bonds, alright? Now, as a very simple revision, remember, shares, shares, we are talking about ownership, alright? But bonds, or sometimes you get, you see, debentures, alright? Sometimes you see debentures, not ownership, but only creditors, alright? See, going on creditor, my owner, So, next one. Which of the following description about ordinary shares? Now, make ordinary shares, eh? Ordinary share, shares, the shares we have been talking about. The shares we have been talking about all are ordinary shares, alright? Now, let me remind you again. Let me remind you again. Preference shares. In the old days, it is required. Nowadays, preference shares is out of syllabus. All right. Now here, bonds and shares. Which one is correct? Now here, investing in ordinary shares will usually use a higher rate of return than investing in bonds. Now this one looks like correct, but it is not correct. All right. Now remember, when would ordinary shares use a higher rate of return? In general. Only when the company is strong, alright? Only when the performance is strong. You need to specify this, alright? You need to specify a strong performance, alright? So one is not correct. Now two, the return from investing bonds is more certain. Yes, it is more certain than investing in uh, ordinary shares. Now, there are two reasons, alright? Two reasons for that. The prime reason, alright? The prime reasons. Dim Gayo Gam Gona. The prime reason. Now many of you actually give me the second reason, which is not the primary reason. Alright, now you say bonds have fixed interest rate. Alright, bonds have fixed interest rate. Yes, you can say that. But the primary reason is not because of fixed interest rate, but because of the obligation to pay. Now, bonds, they have an obligation to pay you a fixed interest rate, no matter whether they are doing good or not. But for, you know, for shares, they actually have no obligation to pay. So even if they have strong performance, they can pay you nothing. That is the primary reason why it is more certain, not because of the fixed interest rate, but because of the obligation to pay. Alright, you know, Tonga, So this one, yes, two is correct. Now, if the company winds up, bondholders can claim repayment prior to ordinary shareholders. Refer to your notes and textbook, alright? Bondholders, I lost in seeing it, alright? Now, the final one. Investing in ordinary shares requires more capital. Bingo gonna tongue more gonna. Bonds can also be expensive. Shares can be cheap, alright? So no, one and four not correct. The answer is A, two and three. Oh we don't that very easy. So let's not waste time and keep moving on. Now here, the board of director of a listed company decides to issue shares instead of bonds, alright, to raise capital. The most likely reason now you know yeah. The most likely reason now, of course, of course, this question is talking about from company's perspective. Alright? Issuing shares will not dilute the control. Remember, issuing ordinary shares will dilute will dilute the control of the system all right has no interest burden this one is correct which means basically they say no obligation to pay all right no obligation to pay to pay dividend so you all right no obligation to pay dividend all right now C issuing shares can reduce the risk of being taken over no just the opposite these two are actually the same all right A and C they are talking about the same thing so D of course not correct okay one final question and then we can move on now here miss miss lamb 
is a small investor. Now, from her point of view, all right. Now, so we are talking about investor's point of view, all right. Which of the following is not an advantage? We need not an advantage. My whole ah, of buying bonds over shares, all right. Now, a she can receive interest regularly. No, this is actually an advantage, all right. This is this is an advantage. Regularly, we say this one obligation to pay bondholders. They will get something certainly. All right, obligation to pay. All right. Now, next one. If the company winds up, she can claim repayment prior prior to shareholders. This one also advantage. All right, higher priority. They have higher priority in liquidation. Is it? 当佢執笠嘅時候啊，佢係高啲嘅次序啊嘛 ，all right？ 嗱 ，she has voting right， 冇還咧，係咪啊 ？This one is not correct， all right？ Bonds， no voting right， no voting right， all right？ No， no voting right， all right？ So this one， 嗱 ，D， the rate of return is more certain， the basically the same， basically the same as A， all right？ 得啦 ，so。That is pretty much for the MC. All right, let's go to the short questions and long questions. Okay, let's turn to the next page and talk about the short questions and long questions. Now, the first one, the Hong Kong Housing Housing Authority, ah, Fang Wu Chu, ah, all right, is a public enterprise and is responsible for. All right, now one A, now. I don't know what is going on with some of you guys. All right, the question is asking, what is are the sources of capital? This money is from where? All right, basically, is asking where does the money come from? So part A quite easy. All right, from what you tell me, not like that. All right, the source of capital is. The Hong Kong government, come on. 香港政府咯，香港政府咪系个诶 source of capital 咯。All right, I don't know why some of you write something that is totally irrelevant for whatever reason. 唔知做乜事。And boys, let me remind you in exam, don't write like this. Don't write like this, please. Use complete sentence, alright? 喂，唔該俾啲完整句子我啊。Use complete sentence, alright? Now B, give two features. Two features, a lot of features. You can copy from textbook, alright? You can copy from textbook. Let me give you the two features, alright? The two features, the most common two features are now many of you. It has. Adequate and stable. Now, his name is adequate. Still okay, lah. Stable source of capital. Now, some of you went further. Now, this is not required, but some of you went further to explain that. Since now, some of you went further and say since. It is operated by the government. All right. Now it is okay. 系啦，嗱解释都好啊，因为系政府啊，政府啲钱最稳定噶啦。All right. This is the first, first, first feature. Second, it also has. Now the next one quite common. All right, quite common as well. Higher. Now remember the word is higher. Average production cost. Hey, 收工咯，得唔得 ？No, wrong. It also has higher average production cost. 好啦 ，Rocky, if you are listening, Rocky, 你听紧嘅话，听住啦。咩叫答题技巧啊？成日衰啲咩？就系呢啲位啊。Higher than what? Higher average production cost. Then who don't miss this? Then private enterprise. 得唔得啊？呢啲答題技巧啊 ！I always write 
be specific. You say hi 啊 ，tell me hi 啊 ，then something 得唔得？你要写出嚟，嗰啲乜先得噶 ？All right. So these are the most common answers. Now some of you also. It has better access to information and statistics. Now this one also good, alright. 嗱，你都可以話啦，原來啦，佢容易得到資訊同埋呢啲數據啊，係有統計處啊嘛，係咪 ？So any one of them. Now there are of course some others. For example, for example, if you remember, you say they have a they have a very stable output at lower price, right? You also see stable output at lower price. So do you know what I'm 咪又係嗰樣係咪啊 ？Lower than what? Then private enterprise. 喂，何仔 ，SJC 成租仔，醒少少得唔得啊 ？Lower than something 啊嘛 ，Lower than private enterprise. 你逢親寫 higher lower， 唔該你寫埋 higher 定 lower 定邊個啦 ？All right. Now first question. This is the first question. Now. Second question. Second question. Kathy is one of the owner. She is planning to sell her shares in a company to others on the stock market. 唔使問啦，即刻知道呢個咩意思啊 ？What type of ownership? It is a listed company. 係咪上市公司啦 ？Or if you write public limited company, also correct. 一樣都啱，得唔得啊？ Public limited company 同埋 listed company both correct, alright. Now, 記住啊 complete sentence 啊 alright. Now, next one. Ah, uh, back to back to the first one first, alright. Now, remember, use structures like this. 係咪 Give me a paragraph. Don't write like this. Don't give me point form. Don't give me something like this. One stable source. Of capital to higher average. No, don't give me something like this. If you give me something like this, I'll give you a minus one poor presentation. All right? No, no. Give me paragraph now. Back to here. To be, to be. If the firm goes bankrupt, does Kathy needs to use her personal asset to repay? No, of course you know the answer is no. She does not need to do so. Now the explanation many of you say because her liabilities are limited. All right, because this is a part. Uh, this is a listed company. All right, her liabilities are limited. Now, this is not a complete explanation. All right, this is not correct. All right, 你要解释 why it has limited liability, and the reason is linked back to the most important characteristics of a listed company, because her liabilities are limited. Due to listed company, 佢有啲咩啊 Having separate legal entity 啊嘛，係因為佢有 separate legal entity， 所以啲 owner 全部都淨係需要。俾翻佢投資咗嘅嘢咯 ，limited liability。So alright, so very a lot of you miss this. Alright, this is very important because the question asks you to explain, not state. Alright, if you say liabilities are limited, this is only stating. You need to explain why limited liability because of separate legal entity. Legal 先叫解釋咗，得唔得 ？Alright, so let's move on. 
Now here, number three, state free changes when it turns into a public limited company into a private. Lah, I'm going to say it again. The question is, from public limited company to private limited company. Some of you get it totally the other way round. So sorry, zero mark. All right, zero mark. All right. Now, when they turn from a public into private, there are actually a lot of things. All right. Now, the first now, also also rocky again. All right. Now you may be asking, 有冇咩答題技巧啊 ？Changes. All right. So. Many of you only tells me the characteristics of a private limited company. Now this time I didn't did that mark, but the best way to answer you should tell me the public something into private something. All right. Now for example, one good one of the good way say first. Let's talk about the transfer of ownership first. All right, the transfer of ownership. Can no longer be done freely, but needs the consent. The consent, go to how to write it. S E N T R. Consent of other shareholders. Now. This is what I call the. Uh, this is what I call exam technique. 答題技巧啦 ，changes 啊嘛，你咪話要 use words like this. No longer， 唔再係乜嘢啦，而係變成咩 ？This is the public changing the private. All right, don't just tell me the private. All right. So second, secondly, now you see this is some very boring English. But remember, this is economics, not the your English subject. So you use simple English, all right? So transfer of ownership, one of them. Second, all right. Second, the company can no longer issue shares and bonds. Sorry, and bonds to the public, but only privately. Now demonstrate again, am I? Ah, changes no longer public, no longer to the public, but all only privately. All right, this is change. Now third one. Third one, actually, most of you answer, answer, most of you answer in this way. Thirdly, 講人數啊 ，the number of owner, all right, can no longer be. No, sorry, is no longer be. Is no longer unlimited, but limited to fifty. All right, this is a zero mark answer. All right, zero 在边度啊？漏咗只好重要字。One very important word is missing. Not the number of owner. The Maximum number of owner. 好啦，有咩问题啊？呢度头先我哋如果唔讲 maximum， 发生咩事啊 ？The problem is if you don't say maximum， 记住啊 ，from a public to private， actually the number of owner may decrease， 有机会少咗噶，系咪啊？好耐之前电信型科咪系咯，私有化啊嘛。上市變咗私有化，有機會多咗或者少咗噶。Let's say originally only three, and then now they say, well, it it becomes better. Then you have more owners. All right. Now it's not the number of owners; it's the 
maximum number of owners no longer unlimited but limited to 50 now change ya same uh, limited to something don't just write limited all right and don't miss out maximum all right if you miss this zero marks okay of course of course you can also write disclosure of information right disclosure of financial information Disclosure of financial information. Now, only go set point form. No longer to the public. Only to shareholders. This is also correct. Okay? So, of course, there are some, uh, still some other answers, but I don't spend time here. Refer to your textbook and your notes, alright? Now, next one. XYZ company is a private limited company. Not private, ah, because I think to ah, private limited company. The owners choose to set up the firms in the form of private limited company, but not a pa partnership, alright? Now, the guy going private limited company versus partnership, alright? Now, say two advantages and two disadvantages, alright? Now, let me demonstrate a common mistakes. The advantages are having separate legal entity and owners having limited liability now you count it as two points but this is actually one point all right why look at here a separate legal entity this is actually a neutral thing. Hai Zhong Lap Gaha Zi Hai Doi Biu Lei Yau Ling Yako San Fan. Gam Yau Ling Yako San Fan Ho Chi Ling Mo Chi Ya O Gui Zi Ya Zhong Lap Gaha Neutral. All right. It is because we have separate legal entity that we face limited, the owners face limited liability. This is one, one point. All right. So Nah, these are very common mistakes. Now, in exam, this, in my exam, these two actually count as one point only. The reason simple. Because it is only because we have separate legal entity that we will have limited liabilities. Only one point. Alright? Now, second point. Second point. Some of you also write. Second point. Nah. Next one. I don't write complete sentence. Alright? Alright? The advantage will have lasting continuity. So anyone withdraw, anyone die, the company will still continue to exist, alright? This one the most common. Of course, there are, are also other advantages, alright? Other advantages, but let's not waste time, alright? For disadvantages, now same la Sigan Guan Hai because of time limitation, I write in point form. But remember, in your answer, do not write in point form or I will deduct marks from you. Poor presentation, alright? Now, disadvantages. They have higher tax rate. Alright, higher tax rate. Alright, higher tax rate. Now, this time, you don't need to write higher than what? Because the question already say private limited company versus a, a public partner, a, a partnership, alright? Now, higher tax rate. Now, let me remind you again, some of you write Pay more tax This is incorrect, alright? Higher tax rate does not mean they need to pay more tax, alright? Let's say, let's say a partnership The profit of a partnership 10 million, alright, 10 million dollars. And a private limited company, 10 dollars. Also, I'm being got paid all this. So, yeah, partnership paid all this. 
this must pay more, more tax, all right? But the tax rate is lower as of now, 15 and 16.5, all right? So it is higher tax rate, all right? Higher tax rate, not pay more tax. I go rate go dear ma. All right. Second, private limited company also have a more complicated setup procedure. Am I legal? Okay, All right. Now, let just as a reminder, some of you said for advantage. Ah, limited company. Wider source of capital. Ah, mama. Wrong. Chua. Tosin gone draw hai maya. Wrong. Why? Because both private limited company and partnership, they cannot. They cannot get capital from the public. So, you cannot write it has a wider source of capital, alright? So, this is a very common mistake. Alright, now let's move on. Next one, next one. Peter has been working in a law firm for years. Later, he set up his own, uh, own law firm. He must bear all legal responsibility. Here, you see. All responsibility, all right, which means basically it says this is unlimited liabilities, all right, basically unlimited liabilities, all right. Now, so yakoyan, one person, unlimited liability, it is a sole proprietorship. Again, complete sentence, all right? Now, B, we need to list two features, all right? Now, there is a, there are a lot of features in your textbook, all right? So I'm not going to write them, but one of them is not. Many of you say, only one owner. This is not N-O-T, a feature, all right? This is not a feature. 喂,大佬,講完都係冇講,我鬼唔知獨資係一個人咩?So, you can not write only one owner, the, by the same token, for partnership, for partnership, you cannot write, own, uh, must be more than one owner, no, that is not a feature, right? Now, in contrast, you are my water. Just now, rewrite here, limited to 50. Please, boys, this question is about changes. Not asking for features, but changes. This is one of the changes, all right? But when you are talking about features, no, not one owner. Partnership, not more than one owner. No, this is no good, all right? Now, of course, for public and private limited company. Now, public and private limited company, they can be able to see it. Alright, why? Why? Because they actually have a difference. They have a difference. They have a difference. They have a difference. That is, because they have a You can distinguish that as a feature. But this one, only one owner, and more than one owner for partnership, is not a feature. Alright? Now, for answers, copy from textbook. Alright? Now, this I'm gonna. You copy from textbook, all right. Now, finally, next one. Suggest two ways to raise capital to uh, to Peter. Now, boys, please use common sense. It is asking for him to raise capital, but the sad thing is, as a sole proprietor. As a sole proprietor, is a So please, 
don't play smart， 唔好懒醒 ，don't be a smart ass， 懒醒啊，得唔得 ？Don't say turn into a partnership or、啊、turn into a limited company。No, please. This is stupid answers, alright? 嗱，真係啊，冇懶醒啊。Of course, we are talking about as a sole proprietor, alright? As a sole proprietor. 嗱 ，I know what you are thinking. You are thinking, no, ah,、uh, Mr. Chan. You look at the previous MC. 我都唔記得邊個，唔記得邊條啦。Let's see. You look at, yeah, here, here, here. You look at previous MC four here. It says turn into something. 喂，大佬咁之前題目講明啊嘛。The setting tells you they change into something, right? But here, please, the question didn't say they turn into anything. So we are talking about as a sole proprietor. All right. Now many many ways. All right, many many ways. For example, borrow from friends. 問朋友借咯。Yes, this is one. I only tried to make it. Borrow from friends, all right? Or、uh, you can take loan from banks. Am I ah? Mun friend, my mun bank. So also, what else? Use his own saving. 用自己私伙钱咯，系咪啊？全部你有創意就寫到啦。哦、oh, ，let's not waste time. Let's move on. Already one hour, so let's speed up. I don't want to. I don't want to make this video too long. Now here, the table shows you the stock market. 唔使問啦，一有 stock market， 知唔知三個屬於咩啊？知唔知三個屬於咩啊 ？They are listed companies. 係咪啊？唔使講啦，呢個嘥時間啦。All right. Now B. Give two advantages and two disadvantages of this type of ownership over partnership. 好啦，呢個唔講啦。But this time, this time, now this one you can refer to. Ah,、uh, here, 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 here. You can refer to four. All right, you can refer to four. Most of it, most of it would be common with question four, except several things. All right. Now I just write down the unique ones. Now here. For advantage, this time you can write it has a wider source of capital because they can issue shares and bonds. 真正咩字？嗱，应该知啦。Publicly. 可以公開發售嘛 ？They can do it publicly. This is the main point, and this is unique to this question because of the setting of listed company or、uh, public li limited company. All right. This is unique. Now for disadvantage. Now this time we have two unique disadvantages. The first one. The first one. Actually, now you sell shares. Now you sell shares. All right, you sell shares by issuing shares. Now, this time you need to specify by issuing shares because the question didn't say issuing shares. You need to specify. You are talking about by issuing shares. There is. Higher risk of being taken over, 係咪啊？俾人收購嘅機會大咗嘛 ？Remember, you need to tell me you are talking about issuing shares. If you only say there is higher risk of being taken over, no marks, all right? Because you didn't specify the background. Now the second one. Now as a public limited company, you also have to need to. Disclose financial or accounting information to the public. 係咪？你仲要公開自己嘅資料嘛？嗱 ，these two are unique 
unique to public limited company. So again, a lot of points in question four, you can use it, all right? Except these ones. These ones are the unique ones, all right? Let's move on, let's move on. We only have three more questions and then we are done, all right? Now here, here, here. Next question. From the point of view, viewpoint of an investor in general. Now we're talking about in general, uh, investors. Now please, boys, highlight the word explain. Not state. This time we need to explain one advantage of one disadvantage of buying bonds over ordinary shares. My bond do you my shares Alright, so let's do it. Actually, a lot of good points, but let me demonstrate. Now, for Rocky again, Rocky you ask me, I demonstrate. What is an explanation? Now let's do it. One advantage is that buying, uh, no, investing in bonds entails a lower risk, entails lower risk. This one only one mark because this part you have only stated you have only stated the advantage you need to explain team guy lower risk ah team guy lower risk ah then you have two ways to explain both are acceptable give me one would be good for example because the company is obliged to pay bond interest. Or another one you can say also re also talk about low risk, alright? Also talk about low risk. They have higher priority to claim money. In case, now most of them higher priority to claim money. Ah, semi in case of liquidation. So, lop ke si hao, ko yao go di priority ma. This is the explanation part, alright? This part is the explanation part. Dum da, explanation. Alright? Now, second point. One disadvantage is that now I'm saying complete sentence and then one disadvantage is that now this time I did that I didn't deduct mark from many of you. Many of you only say disadvantage is that they have no voting rights in the AGM. Now remember this part you have only stated the disadvantage. Now this time I didn't deduct mark from you. I, I didn't deduct mark. But you need to explain no voting rights. The explanation part as bondholders are not owners. This is the explanation part, alright? The you guys You my team base fun they are fun gum guy, alright? Boys, so not just Rocky, all of you learn the trick, learn this technique. This is what we call an explanation. Alright? This is only stating. So sometimes you only copy the big title from textbook. Not good enough. When you are asked to explain, you also need to use the small text in the textbook or use your own word to explain. Alright? You need to elaborate it. Alright? Now this time, Nicholas, you did a good job because you give me all this. I'm a Nicholas. Alright, good job, alright, keep it up, alright, Long Yun, keep you Now, let's move on. Here, this past paper, I think we're actually done it, alright. Now, ABC Company Limited is a private limited company. Now, A, 
define limited liabilities. Now, very easy. It refers to limited liability. Limited liability means the owners. 嗱，系讲 owners 啊嘛，我哋要指明系 owners liabilities are limited or confined to the amount of investment。你投资就几多落嚟，咪你蚀几多咯，唔会蚀多噶，系咪啊？嗱 ，here remember you need this part。Limited to something, 你要寫出嚟噶。The amount of investment you need to specify. If you didn't specify this, zero mark. All right, not just 一分都唔會有啊。Zero mark. All right. Now here for this question is actually two marks. Two mark. All right. Now B, you have to list two features. Now this one copy from textbook. 我唔嘥時間啦，好唔好啊？嗱 here. So the main point of this question, you need to write. Limited or confined to the amount of investment. Say it in Thai, okay? All right, let's go. Let's go. Final question. Final question, and we are done. All right. Now it says Sam is running a firm with Jessica and Eva. All of them are legally responsible for contracts signed by any one of them. Now here, this is what it means. Actually, ah, in the textbook, it means ah, it means collectively responsible, lor. 係咪即係 collectively responsible 咁解啦 ？All right. Now, when we see collectively responsible, immediately we know this is a partnership. 一睇就知啦，係咪啊？唔使嘥時間啦。Partnership. Now, here, so part A. It is a partnership. Oh yeah, so good, 係咪啊 ？Please, boys, some of you so careless. The question. Is not ended. Has not been ended. Has not been fully answered. All right. Please list two features of this type. 唔好漏咗啊，大佬！你又有两分噶。Now any two features will do. Now other features copy from textbook. Now let me remind you again. Some of you said number of owners. More than one. This is not a feature. All right. The reason is simple. 解释咗啦。I don't repeat. So this is not a feature. 听唔得清唔清楚 ？All right. So for the rest, copy from textbook or notes. All right. Or notes. 嗱自己答唔处理啦。All right. Now next one. It says. Later, they expand their business by forming a public limited company. Public, ah, don't that public limit. Now, first of all, ah, 头先讲漏咗 Some of you totally mix up public limited company. 有啲同学啦，一见到 public 就讲咩啊？哦 ，public enterprise 咯。喂，大佬唔好玩我喎。Stop tricking me. All right. Public limited company and public enterprise are two different things. All right. Public limited company is a private enterprise. All right, totally different thing. Now, I don't know why I'm so high on the wrong side. Don't be offended. Please, this is the last time you commit this this mistake. All right, now, public limited company. They are now no longer subjected to unlimited liability. Now, it asks you to explain what is meant by unlimited liability. Now, some of you I know. Now, there are some people who will say, "What is it?" 你啲 MC 咪有講嘅 ，it means 嗱，我唔寫 complete sentence 啊。Some of you write unlimited liabilities means the owner do not need to use personal assets to settle outstanding loans, outstanding debts. Of the company, this is only a one mark answer. All right, you didn't hit the point. You say, 
佢唔使用 personal asset 嚟到去處理 outstanding debts。The question is why？ 點解先？你都冇解釋到。The true way of answering this should be like this。嗱，唔好笑我嚇。Unlimited liability liabilities means liabilities of owners are not limited or confined to the amount of investment。哇，呢個先係個 main point 啊嘛！因為佢哋係 not limited to the amount of investment、啊。s o r r y 呢個係 they need 啊，所以呢個係 need 啊，就 mean。好 ，alright。Because it is not limited to the amount of investment, so the owners need to use their personal asset to settle outstanding debts 啊嘛。見唔見到個分別啊？得唔得？唉，真係激激死啊！真係唔知點解啊。So please, boys, alright. Remember. You always think about who goes first, which one goes first, which one follows, which one is the cause, which one is the result. All right, 系咪啊 ？Cause and effect 唔该谂清楚啲啊。系因为佢系 not limited to amount of investment， 所以佢先要用 personal asset 啊嘛。All right, so this is the point. This is the main point. If you want to score two marks, the full marks, you need to write this. Not the above one. Above one is only an what we call an observation. This is only a phenomenon, a observation, ah, and not the explanation, ah, damn that. This one is an explanation. Now B two, B two. Now this one, let's not spend time. Now he is talking about, ah, he needs to explain. Ah, you need to explain the difference between the private and public limited company. In terms, please, don't mix up things. In terms of transfer of ownership and disclosure of accounting information, now let's be done with it very quickly. Now B two here, B two. Now for public limited company, all right, public limited company. Now they disclose information to the public, right? And also transfer of ownership. No need consent. Of other shareholders, all right. For private, it's just the opposite. Now they disclose share to shareholders only, all right. 係咪即係股東啫嘛 ？Shareholders only, all right. They disclose to shareholders only, and for the transfer. They need consent. 喂，唔該，睇多次啊。Consent 點算啊 ？S C N T 啊，有啲人轉咗 C N T 啊。Consent of other owners. All right. 嗱，呢個啦，唔講咁多啦，抄書嘅啫。Now, final one. The company can issue ordinary shares and bonds to raise capital. From point of view of company, please. We are talking about company, not. From the point of view of investors, 我哋唔係由 investor 嘅角度睇啊，由 company 嘅角度啊 ，state one advantage and one disadvantage. All right, now I think most of you write this way. Advantage. All right. Ah, I I don't write complete sentence. All right, but you yourself you need to write complete sentence. All right. Advantage. All right. Advantage. Now, ah, first of all, this question, state. So no need to explain. No need to explain. All right. No need to explain. Now here, it says the advantage. The advantage is quite simple. 係有有咩有咩 advantage 啊 ？No obligation to pay dividend. All right. No obligation to pay that. Or some of you from your MC, you see, you have no interest. Now, but I think the more correct should be no dividend burden. All right. 冇噶，冇 burden 呀。No obligation to pay dividends. All right. Regardless whether now, of course you can write. Of course you can continue. Regardless whether 
regardless of company's performance。就算間公司強定弱啦，係咪啊？就算間公司強定弱，都唔使啦，唔使俾啦。All right， but for disadvantages， 嗱離唔開嘅啫，係咪 ？Disadvantages。May dilute the control of existing of existing shareholders 啊嘛，系咪？有機會會 dilute 咗佢哋嘅 control 啊，係咪啊 ？So 嗱 ，some of you con 誒、uh, continue to give me may so it may disturb the structure. Alright, the structure of company. Yes, that is true. Now, because you know, new ownership, new ownership may be disturbed. Alright, or、uh, you can write in another way. Now, I don't write, I don't write, but you can.、Uh, it may increase the risk of being of the company being taken over. Alright, it may、e、further increase the risk. 你發行多啲 shares 啊，大 lose 咗佢，係咪其實有機會俾人收購咗啊 ？You may increase the risk. Of being taken over. All right. So, boys, this is pretty much our homework free. All right. Now, for this homework, I, most of you did quite well. So, again, remember this chapter very factual. So you need to do your recitation work. They gave you a brochure, and, and here for this video, we have also gone through the answering technique. 乜嘢叫做 state？ 系咪啊？呢啲啦。What it means by stating, what it means by explaining. All right. So, boys, remember you need to be sensitive to words like this. Explain and the words like this. State you need to be very sensitive to these words because different operative words means different answering approach. All right, 係咪啊？你要用翻啱嘅 approach 嚟到去 answer 啦 And remember, be specific. All right. Now here, just a final reminder. Be specific. When you say, when you say, features, it has higher something, higher average production cost. You need to tell me higher than something. All right, 唔好就咁讲 higher, higher than something, than lower than something. All right, it's the same. Lower working efficiency than private enterprise. 系咪啊？你要讲 lower than higher than 啲乜噶嘛 ？All right, 记住啦。Be specific in answer and be sensitive to the operative words of a question. All right. So this is the end of chapter three homework explanation. All right. Now next time I will take a new video to do a summary of chapter three as a revision. All right for our notes. And then we have one more video. I will go through as usual all the past paper in your past paper booklet. All right. Until then. Stay tuned for new videos and thank you very much. Good night, boys.